Hi, and welcome back to Fox in the Box. I'm your host, Sebastian, and today we're playing more Night in the Woods. And last time, ba uh, uh, I went to sleep, and now we're in some strange area. And also, we captured a bunny head someplace. Whoa! Okay. Not sure what's going on there. Who's here? There's some sort of shadowy figure there. Hi, uh, who are you? Huh. Low gravity, sweet. Uh, I'm not sure where we're supposed to go. Hmm. Okay, this way, that looks kind of creepy. Oh, hi! Some sort of ghost dude. Oh, that's kinda of pretty, I like that. That way is nothingness. It's birds! Hi birds! I'll eat you! Aww. Hmm. Alright, I think I need a jump, a good, good jump for this one. Ready? I'm gonna eat you now. I'm gonna eat you. Huh, cool. There's a pattern in the stars there. That was that looks like me with someone's head in the hands. Uh oh. Or Aunt Molkop. There you go. That looks like Aunt Molkop. Huh. What Aunt Molkop is doing in that? You know, Aunt Molkop is killing people. What's up this way? Ooh, looks like there's something this way. Wee! Huh. Okay. It is like some medical symbol on this trombone. I guess I'm supposed to find all these people. Uh, oh, it looks like uh, it might be Craig there or a Fiasco Fox. That's kind of cool. Oh boy, I'm falling. Oh, I didn't fall too hard. Huh. What's this familiar? Like, a ghost orchestra. Oh wow, everything's been in the story now. What else can I do here? I wonder. Shadowy figure, are you doing anything? Ah, those are all lit up now. Oh, this is light this up. And what are you? A bear or something? And something's happening to me. Okay. Alrighty, I think this game is starting to get trippy. <laughs> mm. I guess it's some sort of ritual or something. Alright, time to wake up, May. <laughs> Alright, let's check out our computer. See if there's anything going on. Um, Craig, of course. Craig, good morning. I'm somehow even more sore. This is bullshit. I'm working uh, today. Uh, uh, Angus is out of town, and I'm lonely. Okay, bye. See you, see, see you regularly. Aww. Hi, Charcoal. Alright, let's get out of that. Let's go visit Craig. Uh, Greg, I mean. 
But apparently he's having some issues. He's lonely, so I got to keep him company. Okay. Oof, I need a shower. I noticed that her dad or mom were never. Oh, well, never mind. I need maybe a correction on that. I was about to say that they're never in the same place at the same time, but I have seen them together before, I think. Good morning. Do you feel uh, uh, feel it last night? What? There was a big uh, sinkhole two streets over. Oh, are we still getting those? I don't think uh, those really ever go away. <laughs> Swampy ground and so forth, and on a food plane, a floodplain. Oh, weird. I don't want you to go uh, over and nosing around it. I guarantee you I won't. I have seen sinkholes. No interest at all? Mom, there's just a... Mom, there's just a sink uh, hole in the ground. You get back to me when one swallows a house or something. We'll go see, uh, we'll go to, uh, see together if that happens. Deal. So what did you do last night? Hung out with Greg. Oh, what did you do? Uh, we went to the grocery store. That sounds exciting. Get anything special? Oh boy, sure did. <laughs> well, stop by the church if, uh, you're in the area. We'll do, Mom. See ya. Mm-hmm. Bye, sweetie. Okay, I guess we need to stop by the... the church. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, it's raining. Hi, squirrel. There you go. I find this is quicker than just going like that. Whee! Boing! Bounce. Let's get the squirrels. Arr. I know apple bomb. Okay, oh yeah, that's right. I already looked at this guy. Following the next scene, or I'll just be on the ground already. Oh, I was on the ground already. Okay. Psst. All right. Oh boy. Scary place. What was over here? Doing on fire. Ah. What's over here? No, 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 so I there's something coming after me, I'm like, what? Huh, that's a small building. Hey, Mom! Hey, sweetie. I completely forgot to, uh, where the sanctuary is. Um, you passed the door on your way, here. Oh, I thought those were locked. They're locked sometimes. All doors are locked sometimes. Not like saloon doors. Can always just walk in and out. That's very rude. <laughs> the Old West was a very rude time. Howdy, partner. Ah, say ah, this is po uh, powerful, rude. That's like Southern gentleman. <laughs> He's classing the place up. Ah, I guess we can go in there. And watch me catch on fire because she's not supposed to be in there. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, 
Uh oh, this person looks like a prude. Hi, prudish looking person. Can I jump on that? I guess not. Love, peace, joy. Hmm. Hello. Hello. Your candy's out, alright? Yep, who are you? Kate, but, uh, most people call me Pastor K. You're new here, right? 60 months, something like that. Oh, new to me at least. Hello. 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 Do me a favor. Take that last hello and give it to Bruce. Bruce? Bruce lives across the street. In the woods? For now at least. Want me to go talk to a strange, uh, strange man in the woods? Bruce isn't strange. He's my friend. And he's part of this community. Okie dokie. Thank you. It was nice to meet you. You too. Ah, oh, okay. Pastor K. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here and go to the next area. Oh, I didn't need to click anything for that door. Alright, I'll head there next. I'm going to talk to Craig first. Someone needs to keep him company. While oh, this big teddy bear is gone. <laughs> On. Load up ready. Ah, you got a little rice scooter. Can I hit your ride? Can I hit your ride, please? In your basket? On the back of that? No? Okay. Hurts! That's right, uh, he's gone for the time. Especially kitties, nah. Hey, Greg. I'm gonna, st I'm gonna just step on you now. Well, maybe not. Freak Ghost. Ooh, that's cool. Wait, did the, does this display change a bit? Oh, maybe I didn't look at that before. Oh well. What's up, dude? Uh, was thinking about going to jail. Like you're planning on going? Like planning on going? I think I could break out. Maybe I should, I should like test my skills of escape. I feel like the risk is bigger than any possible reward. Yeah. I brought this up. How did I met me about going to jail? My cousin went to jail. My other cousin, uh, Jen, said it was inevitable. Aw oh, man, you're not inevitable. I mean, it's not... I mean, it's not... I mean, it's not inevitable. No, go back. I'm definitely inevitable. Inevitable. The inevitable Greg. Is Angus around today? Nah, he's uh, off doing some stuff. What stuff? Eh, family stuff. They're not worth talking about. Yeesh! <laughs> Gonna hang out? Uh... I'll come back. Cool later. I'll come back and hang out with you. That's fair. Jerseys. I think that mysterious stranger in the woods would be worth a visit. Possibilities. Oh, closed. Yeah, there's two. Why do I keep reading this off? I know one thing about myself. It's when, even when I'm driving or anything I'm doing in general, whenever I see a sign and walk past something that has words on it, I generally just read them out. Like, especially for businesses. I'm not sure why. Why do I do that? Ah! Oh. Hi there! Looks like you're expecting young one, or you're hiding watermelon. You should sure these are stolen from the grocery store. One or two. Alright, let's go back to the, uh... Let's go to the woods then. And say hi to the homeless guy. No, I mean, you need a bike. So you can get around faster. Uh-oh. Okay. 
Since you're more of a drifter. Yeah, but it's temporary. Of course, we just want to see if you're okay up here. Yeah, uh, Presser Key has been very kind. Why if we uh, see you set up here? What do you think, Molly? Uh, uh, it's fine. Ah, uh, all right, Bruce. Oh, yeah. How are you finding Ponza Springs? Nice place, nice peaceful. How long have you been in uh, town, Bruce? I've been here for a while now. It was like, I was here uh, before back in the 70s. We were looking for miners, at least for a while. Got a whole thing going on here, Bruce. Yep. Pretty impressive. Uh, thanks. <laughs> His eyes went shifty. Well, we sure appreciate you talking to us, Bruce. It was really great to meet you. Yep, likewise. Alright, troops, let's move out. Thanks again, Bruce. Thanks, Bruce. No trouble. Let's talk to Bruce. Hello, I'm Abe Borowski. Uh, friend of Pastor Kate? Hey, I'm Bruce. His eyes went shifty again. I don't say much. That's fine. I talk a lot. Hmm. But I can like not. <laughs> okay. So Bruce lives out in the woods here. Ooh, it's over here. I always wanted to climb that tower. But then uh, that one kid died doing that. Whatever. I'll get to it. Probably see clear to my uh to brittle from here. From there, yes. What's over this way? Nothing, just a cliff and a drop. And graffiti, lots of graffiti. Hmm. That drop reminds me of something. Forgot what exactly, but that's familiar. Bye, Bruce! Alright, now it's time to hang out with Greg. Who does want to hang out with adorable fox? Man. She was just like, run lots faster. Whee! Satch is missing his head. Huh. Neat. Duke Possum Springs. What? Why would you want to Duke Possum Springs? That's where you live. Ghost Lung. Hmm, interesting. stuff ended up. I remember the spring parade, it was so much fun. Until the year that uh, Mallard Pete uh, Bloomingrow? Uh, Bloomingrow snapped his uh, tether and 
win over Chris Evers. Then they canceled the parade. Cowards. They couldn't cage Mallard. Uh, uh, Mallard needed to be free. And neither ropes nor the poor legs of uh, Chris Evans could hold him back. I wonder what ha happened to bo uh, the, both of them. Oh, I guess there's more here. Okay, and then... Da da da, more stuff. Okay, I don't care about the parade stuff. What? Oh my god! Mallard! What have they done to you? <laughs> oh, wait, I can actually do stuff with you? Mallard, you're pregnant! It's one of those god things. Like where you have a baby because of God. Holy crap! You are the cutest vermin. Who's the best vermin? You are! You look so hungry. Is that why um you're not doing anything? I'll come back with food. Don't die! Aww. See the bullet in the hole, uh, hole in it. Oh, okay. How did, uh, did that not kill them? I must have missed all the important parts of the brain. Wow. Yeah, great, great. Granddad was pretty tough. But isn't that the helmet the fascists were wearing? Ugh, no, wrong, war. And wrong country. These weren't the bad guys. Here's some history. Jeez, okay. When did you learn all this stuff? When people kept uh, saying it was a uh, fascist hat. So what are, you, are we doing? Doing our crime spree! Oh yeah! Follow me! Yes, dear leader! I am both a, le a leader and a deer. Rain sure cleared up. Where are the moose for us? So what do I need this back for? Ta-da! Ooh la la! F up that car, Private Blowski. So, you brought me here to watch me beat up a car. So this is like the, the thing where people are all hot for car crashes. No, and I don't know that movie. Look it up. Eh. So we are, uh, so we need uh, the battery out of this car. What for? It's a privilege, uh, that's privilege info, private. 
Stop calling me by me. I'm a general at least. No, I'm the general. I got a hat. Where's the stupid? Watch it. Roar got me this hat. Okay, but what if uh, someone needs uh, this car? I think it's safe to say no one's gonna miss it. Uh, I guess it's got, uh, got a tree going through it. Oh, there's a tree going through it. Okay. So we're just uh, beating it to the hood off of it? Nah. Yeah, I just smashed it up. Smashed it all up. Smashed up the capitalism. Smash the government. Smash the scar. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I agree. You want to do the honors? I don't want to get electrocuted. He should be fine. The car's got a tree growing through it. Probably not electric anymore. Wait, but... you want to do it or not? Yeah, I'll do. As soon as I grab one of the uh, wires and yank it off. Thanks, I can figure it out. i to get rid of these leaves first. There we go. Okay, so we gotta yank one of the wires. It's not gonna shock me, probably. Ah! Ah! Whoa! I think I died. Now it's in Charcoal. Hey, Charcoal. What are you doing here? You always been here. Uh, you always been a good friend, me. Every day you uh, visit me. You remember to click me. You just say it, just to say hello. Yes, I'm an excellent friend. Charcoal, am I dead? Yes. Are you here to take me to the other side? Yes. And as in the old legends, your soul has been uh, weighed against your transgressions. Oh, and how did that turn out? Uh, <laughs> today you should join your ancestors in the stars. Oh, that's nice. Yes, it's nice. So, like, all my ancestors? Yes, all of them. Like, back to the fishes and dinosaurs? Because of the evolution? Yes, probably. That's neat. <laughs> what? Ha uh, dude. Okay, I bet that's uh, Craig laughing. Ah. Uh, oh, shit. You okay? I think I died. <laughs> How long was I out? Like five seconds. Oh, weird. Time like stretches. It's a mysterious universe. Be good to go with that battery? You know it. Let's get back to the apartment. I taste space. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, even if it was a fascist helmet. It's gonna, uh, it's got an anarchy symbol on it now. Which makes it good. And there's a bullet in a hole in it. So whatever. Wearing it, it is dead. So whoever, so whoever was wearing it was dead. And I'm like wearing the trophy. So you admit that is a fast summon. No! I don't! Oh, okay. So what are we doing? So, okay, so... Oh, wow. <laughs> That's the, uh... Wow, you moved that to, into your the couch yourself? Yep. The stairs last night. I'm very impressive. Okay, well, this sounds straightforward enough. Kind of, it's just uh, full of garbage. It's too bad if you uh, didn't cut, uh, cut yourself on it and get a disease. It's why you didn't uh, die on the way here. It's too bad the robot wasn't filled with angry snakes and then killed and they killed you. It's too bad the uh, elevator didn't fall and squash you like a pancake. Oh, dude, that's not a phobia. <laughs> that's uh, that's the one that makes makes sense at least. What are we doing again? Who 
with this mount. Now, there's something that I was living in there. Hey! I have an idea. Why don't you stop uh, being so negative? Why don't you eat your own neck? That's impossible! But serious, be serious. This is business. Oh well. Well, don't get mad uh, at me. I've already uh, died once tonight. No video or anything. What was it like? <laughs> I can taste my tooth feelings. And it's like they're ringing. Ringing? Like little bells inside my skull. Wow! Yeah! Okay, let's do this. Clamp it on. I'm gonna get shocked again, aren't I? Oh, maybe not. Jeez! That looks safe. Are any of you all boring now? Just because you uh, died for like four or five seconds? Dude! Come on! Some people have uh, been dead like forever. Do you see them whining? Um, right. You either shut up, uh, shut up and you. We have become a ghost. Are you saying I should become a ghost? Yeah! Carpe diem! Carpe diem! Oh, look, it's all fancy in French now. Okay, fine. What are we doing? The best part, we're going to put this to get these together. So you do know how like it works together? We're going to find out. Cool. Hey. Sorry. Cool. Woohoo. <laughs> oh, okay. Just starting house. No, bad house. Okay, here are the parts. Wow, so many possible combinations. We can create our own unique metal offspring. So we just uh, clank these together? Yeah, it's nothing together. Tighten some screws. What can go wrong? I mean, quite a lot of uh, times stuff goes wrong. Dude, you're no fun. There you just die. Right. I'm not sure what to do here. Does the neck need to part? Maybe not. There you go, I got necked. <laughs> uh, maybe not that way. Hmm. Where's that a foot? <laughs> arm pieces there. Ah, oh, so I'm not giving him a long neck or something. Alright, I think we created a monstrosity. He's beautiful! He's perfect! Our beautiful boy! Our robot son! So, like, this is pretty great and all. It reminds me! Why don't we just put a bunch of garbage together in your living room? And connect it to a stolen car battery. That's already leaking acid onto the carpet, I think. <laughs> I don't know. So if you've been back in town, I think I missed Greg, uh, I think I missed Greg of a few years ago. Hmm? Like these days, I mostly work all the time, but... Now that you're back in Boston Springs, I was like, Hey, let's do some uh, crimes again! Ah, oh, dude. Yep. So I was thinking about uh, how to use uh, that for, like, good. So I th uh, thought I'd bring uh, this here for Angus. 
That's beautiful, dude. I'm sure you'll love it. <laughs> She's not impressed. Because you're using sarcasm there. Anyways, I hope so. I hope so. Okay, so. Yeah, all we need to do is turn it on. Oh, oh! I won't push the button. Let me push the button. Let me do it. Dude, it's the least I can do. For my best friend back from the dead. Pizza party next time I, uh, I die and come back. Dude, that is such a good deal. Sweet. <laughs> Alright. Thanks to more like sweet. Oh, God. This side smells even worse. Hope whoever is living here. Uh, hope what was ever living here in this hole. Oh, okay. I think I see it. Alright, push it, push it. Hey, I'm glad you and Angus have this whole thing, whole, like, life together. Thanks, dude. We worked hard. That's sweet. Push it, push it. Okay, okay, okay. I'm just to clear off the leaves. Yay, leaves. And then, pushing. Hmm. Ah! <laughs> yeah, there you go. Yeah, she keeps getting electrocuted. <laughs> yeah, Craig, you're not helping your friend is cooking alive. Whoa! Who lives? What the? Hi. <laughs> whoa! 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 Hey, <laughs> Angus. How's it going, May? Good! I didn't die this time. You? <laughs> You're good. I was just gonna lay here for a while if that's okay. Okay. Goodness, these episodes are getting longer. May, are you still alive? I hope so. Alright, let's talk to the dad figure. How's work? You know, better than the glass factory. This? I've mined, I've mined, I've ran machines, but now I get to slice steaks and hawk ant salamis. I mean, it's easier on the back, that's for sure. But do you like it? I like having a paycheck. Where? Paychecks, the sweetest meats of all. I guess I need to find food for those little rats eventually. Alrighty. Uh, I will think I'll call it here for now, and I'll see you all next time in Fox in the Box. Well, that's a machine that we put together to uh, start killing the town? Who knows? I'll see you all next time. Bye. Just give me foxes in boxes, be they orange or be they white. Foxes in boxes, that fluff is dynamite. I need foxes in boxes, all the best games that are played. Take foxes in boxes, and then you got it made.